What's going on guys? Once again I'm talking about the NFL offseason today for the second time about a franchise running back who has agreed to a deal with his current team. Matt Forte was the first one to come to terms. I was reading articles about him and then the news articles started popping up about Ray Rice and the Baltimore Ravens agreeing to a new contract. And so I forget all the players that were franchise tag but that makes Breeze, Ray Rice, and Matt Forte probably the three biggest names that were franchise tag that now have long-term contracts. And so Matt Forte got a four-year deal and now Ray Rice got a five-year deal and both these players are very important pieces to their respective offenses and in my opinion they're both the biggest playmakers on those offenses. I mean they both have some talent around them as well but without Matt Forte and without Ray Rice both of these offenses are far worse and so Ray Rice gets a five-year deal and I don't know the exact terms of Forte's contract yet but I'm reading about the contract Ray Rice got and I guess the deal is worth 40 million dollars and in the first year he's going to make 17 and he'll make 25 over the first two years combined that leaves the last three years at about five million dollars a year and if Ray Rice is still playing at a high level and for an example he last year he was the NFL leader in yards from scrimmage with over 2,000 and so if he's gonna be still an elite running back or one of the top running backs in the league come a few years down the road does he hold out because of the small numbers because this is a front-loaded contract. I mean, this wouldn't be the first time we've heard of this. There are players out there who sign front-loaded contracts, like Darrell Revis, and then once they get their big paydays their first couple of years, they hold out for a new contract if they're still a good player. But we won't know if that is the case with Ray Rice until a few years down the road. But I think this is a good deal right now for Baltimore as they retain one of their best offensive playmakers and one of the most versatile running backs in the NFL, both receiving and catching out of the backfield. Ray Rice is a dangerous threat, and it's good to see him stay with the Baltimore Ravens with this long-term deal now for the next five years. And so anyways, guys, leave your feedback on this situation here with Ray Rice signing his contract and staying a Baltimore Raven for the next five seasons. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like on the video and I'll see you guys next time.